Thursday. Um, hope you're having a good week and uh, glad that you came back to um, see some healthy meals. And so um, I just wanted to share a little bit. I've had a few people ask questions um, about the health program that Dee and I are on, so I thought I'd answer a few of those here. Um, the main thing I want to do is just kind of tell how we got involved. So um, for those of you who know me, um, I got extremely heavy um, at one point, weighed 262 pounds, and uh, actually had gastric bypass surgery and lost about 100 pounds, but just within a couple of years had gained about half of that back. And so got involved with this particular um, health program, and I like that it's a health program, it's not a diet, and have just fell in love with it and just um, love sharing it with other people. And so if you're interested or if you know of anybody else that might be interested, if you would either share this video to your page or tag them in the comments, somebody that might be interested, I would love to, to talk to you about what we do and how this program works and how it can benefit people. Um, we know that if our bodies are healthy, then we are better equipped, our bodies are better equipped to fight off disease and viruses. And so at this point when people are trying to get healthy and stay healthy, I would love to share this with them and, and help either you or friends or your family get healthy and stay healthy. And I have a pay it forward gift that I would love to share um, if there's somebody that might, that might be interested in that pay it forward um, is something that I can offer to help anybody that might want to get started. So, um, that being said, then um, I'm going to get started tonight and we're going to have Szechuan shrimp and broccoli tonight. And uh, just for those of you who don't know, I also have a YouTube page. So, if you want to go and look at, at my YouTube page, it's called Faye's Healthy Cooking at Home. So, just a side note on that. So. Um, to get started, um, they did not have fresh broccoli when I went um, to the store this time. So I did have frozen broccoli. It's not going to be quite as that tender crisp as I would like to have normally when I would use fresh broccoli, but we use what we can find. So um, just a little bit of olive oil in the bottom of my pan. Just maybe not even a teaspoon, just a little bit. This is a non-stick pan. So um, I went ahead and uh, thawed my broccoli so that it could get started quicker. And so I'm just gonna put that broccoli in there and let it get started. And so while that is getting started and, and cooking, I'm gonna make the sauce. So in the sauce, I have a teaspoon of minced garlic and a teaspoon of minced ginger. Y'all know how I love the ginger. So there's my ginger. I have three tablespoons of chili sauce. This one is not the hot, that's not the sriracha, that's a little sweet. One tablespoon of soy sauce and a tablespoon of rice wine vinegar. So put that all in here together and just give that a quick stir. So, have we got anybody on D? Yes, we do. <laughs> a lot of people or anybody asking I'm questions? Let me go back. Or? We have Irene Reese Deuce, Irene. Um, Christy Kingston, Joyce Sharp Cormier, Christy, oh, hey, Joyce. Christy Kingston Barnett. Christy's joining us. Hey. Luann, Leanne Loudermilk, sorry about that. And Billy Fryer. Oh, hey, Billy. Billy's. Billy is all the way out there in Stanton, so she's joining us from, from a ways off. So, um, so just getting the broccoli started, it is gonna go actually a little quicker with the frozen broccoli versus the fresh because this is kind of already hard cooked before they freeze it, so it's already a little bit tender. So to this, I'm going to add thawed shrimp that has been 
shell, the vein, and the tails off. Now, you don't have to do the tails off. I just don't like to mess with the tails. So, it's just simpler for me to do the tails off. Um, this is raw shrimp. So, that's going to take, again, because it's raw, it will take just a little bit longer to cook. But shrimp is really quick, cooked quickly. If you wanted to get um, the already cooked, then really all you're going to be doing is heating it. And it would go even a little quicker than this is going to, to go with, with the, the raw. So, um, anybody have any questions? Any? I'm, we're going to be cooking shrimp here for just a second. So, anything going on? Um, I hope everyone is healthy and keeping a safe distance and staying home as much as possible with everything that's going on. So, um, got anybody else? So we have Rebecca Lowen. Ah, oh, Rebecca's out there. And Kathy Parks. Ah, <laughs> uh, um, Rebecca's out there in, in uh, Seminole. So, okay, you can see the shrimp is already starting to turn a little pink. Kathy there. in Sonora. Kathy's in Sonora. And so, since this is already starting to turn just a little pink, um, I'm going to quickly start my cauliflower that's in the microwave. It's just frozen. And I'm going to get it started. Um, I bought the pre-riced cauliflower um, mostly because I'm lazy. I, you can rice your own. I have riced my own. It makes a mess. It just, all the little bitty pieces of cauliflower make a mess. So, um, I started buying the pre-riced cauliflower. You know, I, I talk about the, the money aspect and you actually could save money by buying the fresh and doing it yourself, but um, I'm lazy. So. Uh, so to this, I'm going to add the sauce that I made earlier. We have Mike and Denise McDonald ah, joined us. Yeah, out Lubbock way. Uh, so for those of you that are just hopping on, we're doing Szechuan shrimp and broccoli tonight, and so that's just going to coat that. And finish cooking and we're just going to be hanging out for a couple of minutes so we let this shrimp finish cooking and the rice cauliflower finish in the microwave so y'all say something to me y'all talk to me say something <laughs> so uh, otherwise we're just gonna be sitting here staring at each other um, we had a beautiful day here today um, nice weather, got out, walked my dog, wore my dog out, uh, had to carry her the last block. She's a Yorkie, so it's not like she has very long legs, but uh, shows how long it's been since I've been out walking my dog, since I had to carry her the last block. Um, saw a lot of bears, stuffed bears in the windows. I don't know if where you are, if uh, people are doing the bear hunts for the kids. But our neighborhood is doing that, and people are putting um, stuffed bears in their windows. So when the kids are out walking, riding their bikes or whatever, uh, they can document where they've found bears and have a little bear hunt. So um, this is going to take eh, just another minute or two here, and all that shrimp will be nice and pink. Christy Kingston Barnett. Did I say her name already? Yeah. And yeah. Christy Higgins. Oh, hey, Christy. So, yeah. We got people from, from all over. All over the state. So, uh, just, just hanging out, waiting on the shrimp. Like I said, it cooks really quickly. That's one of the things about a quick meal. Um, using shrimp is that it does cook really fast. So this is going to be another one of those meals that we do that's going to be 10 minutes or less. So 
the time we're done. So, uh, got just about another minute on the cauliflower, and then we will plate this, and we will be done. And we're going to actually be right at 10 minutes from the time we started until we're done. Uh, would have been, again, just a little bit longer had we used fresh broccoli instead of the frozen, but we had to use what we could find. So I hope that y'all are not um, having to do without necessities where you are. It's We've been pretty good here, I think. Been a couple of things I haven't been able to find, but for the most part, um, it's been good and, and we've been able to, to get what we need. So. Um, all right, I'm going to get this cauliflower. And I absolutely love this stuff. So it just it cooks in the bag, and then when it's done, you just open it up and pour it out. And that's it. So I'm going to just use about half of this for one serving. Y'all know almost all of my stuff is two servings, since it's just me and Dee. And then half of this on top of there. And we are done. We have Szechuan shrimp and broccoli, all finished in less than 10 minutes. And again, we're talking about price. This one's a little pricier because again, I'm lazy with the cauliflower, but um, everything included, the broccoli, the shrimp, the cauliflower, everything came out to $10. So feeding two people at about $5, a healthy home cooked meal in 10 minutes. You could not call and order. So um, just, Glad y'all joined us. Who you said some just came on? Yeah, I want to say hello to Charles Butts, Tammy Huckabee, and Patsy Reed for our. Oh, hey! Time, so. All right. So, um, just quick recap: we did shrimp and broccoli with cauliflower rice tonight. And um, if you know of anybody that might be looking to get healthy or want a healthy eating plan, um, tag them in this video. Send them my info. I would love to help them, especially with everything that's going on in the world today. So thank you for joining us and we will see you back next Thursday.